Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to send SMS in your Android app. Okay, so we are going to basically design one app from scratch with no content in it. And then one by one, we will add our elements. And at the end, we will make it send SMS through our real device. We can test this on emulator, but that won't be able to send the SMS. Okay, so let's first start with activity underscore main XML. So inside here, I have real relative layout and I'm going to add linear layout. So linear layout, then Android layout width, wrap content, then layout height, wrap content. And I'm going to set Android orientation okay and set it to vertigo and then inside this layout I'm gonna add one text view and then one edit text okay so one text view that wraps content okay so let's have ID As, let's say text one okay and then edit text wrap content wrap content Android ID okay so edit one is its ID so what my text view will show here is I want to display some content like let's say I want to display Android text and here I want to say enter phone number okay so below that exactly we will have our edit text where our number will be added then the next thing we want to add one more text view okay wrap content wrap content then Android ID and here I'm gonna add text to okay and here I just want to say Android then text here I want to use enter content so next is edit text here I want to use wrap content wrap content and then Android ID here I want to say edit to okay and finally we, we are going to add one button so that it can send our content so Android ID and ID here is button 1 and we also need to add one action so that it will add let's say send SMS as our buttons action okay so pretty much everything is added we add a phone number field then for edit text it will be taken then we added enter content then edit to then send SMS okay so that's pretty much we added everything you don't have to call for this text view it's, we are just placing them so inside main activity dot java let's use private button button then use let's say edit text and that field we want is phone number first and for second we want to use text sms okay so the content of sms within second edit field now inside on create method we will create instance of okay so button is here find view by id our ID and then button one. Next is 
our let's see phone number for which we are going to take edit text and then find your ID R ID and then next is edit one okay and then we have our text SMS which will be also edit text find view by the R ID dot edit two okay now when we press on our button it should send the content from our edit two to the number specified in edit one edit text fail okay so we're gonna use button dot set on click listener then new view dot on click listener now inside this we have to use public void on click so this method will accept argument zero and here what we're gonna do is we're gonna use one string named phone okay this basically will get the content from our phone phone number field then we can get this from get text okay the dot to string okay now same we want to do for our message okay so string sms and then text sms dot get text then dot to string closure so from here all that we want to do is we want to use one try catch method so inside try catch I'm gonna use SMS manager okay sorry should be small SMS manager then SMS manager equals to SMS manager dot get default so let's check for that okay we found it and then next thing to do here is to call for send text message sms manager dot send text message that's the last method okay so we're gonna call phone then we will have null then third is intent which will be our sms here then pending intent so that will be null and then pending intent delivery intent that should be null too okay so once we added all this next thing to do is we are going to use toast okay so toast dot make text then get application context so application context of that sms sent okay and then we can use toast dot length short or long you can choose either okay then close this and call for show okay that's your try block and then you're going to use catch add one exception e and that object should be used in your toast so toast dot make text get application context then sms fail okay and then toast dot length log okay and finally come out and say show okay and also you can print this stack dress okay so this is pretty much our program is and one thing here to tell you that you cannot use our emulator to send this sms 
but we are going to check if it goes properly with the rest of the element and we can choose to add content in our program okay so we are going to test the basic Okay, so the application is loaded here you see enter phone number part where you can enter your phone number then you have your content part okay where you can type your content anything randomly and you have this field too let me check if it's clickable okay so it is and let me add one number okay so I can do that but inside the emulator it won't show anything okay so if i click send sms it will either crash or it will not send that sms here so in such case i suggest executing this application in your real phone